Howdy y'all, I'm Round the Wheel, you're watching Custom Level Chaos, and the truncatedness of this world is especially evident. There's no hammer, there's no canoe, there's no nothing. There are a few pyramids though, that is a cute little touch. Alright, we've already got our first neon level. That is one thing you can say about these neon levels, they are definitely a design choice. This one is black and green. These look like, these look like the kind of sneakers that I, these... These look like LA gear light up sandals that I had when I was in second grade. Except those were, we'll probably see a black and blue level. Those were black and blue, so we'll probably see that level yet. Oh, do not want to lose a fire flower. The fire flower seems to be the most valuable power up so far. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't want to lose that to some, some rogue rando. Oh, hey, there you go. Bye bye now. All right. Why don't we clear out here? Oh, hey! Well, I was watching a 1-up and a Goomba landed right smack on dab on my head. Dabbed on that hater. The hater being me. I hate the Goomba man. The Goomba man is... Ah, there we go. I get my flower back now. Fantastic. I was saying something earlier about something and I wanted to continue the thought. Hello, Mr. 1-up. Don't mind if I do. This is, uh... This is very... This is very wild. Watching these... These neon levels. I feel a little bit scared. This feels like that uh, cave in Giant Land. Oh, hey! Pa I should have known by the shape of the by the shape of the water mounds that there would be pop up cheap cheeps in here. All right, well let's run across. Ah, tagged at the very end. I can't believe it. But I got a mushroom flower star. I always thought you should get more one ups for getting mushroom flower star. That's technically a lot harder to get than any other combination. Certainly any other combination of just three straight ones? Oh boy, a musicless level. That's creepy. Did they mean to do that? Oh wow. That I'm very What the okay. Well this is this is basically uh a Mario One ripoff, and the lack of music is really creepy, I gotta say. Um let's try let's try the leaf. Let's try we can probably get a Whoa, good grief. We can probably Nope, I was going to say we can get a good batch of running speed and fly over all this garbage, but man, easy to get hit in this level. I Come on, I got on top of that. That thing was completely underfoot. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely going to have to... Okay, I only have so many power-ups. Let's see if I can't... Uh... Okay, I'm going to use my mushroom. I'm going to try to be a little bit careful. Okay, they seem to pop up in the same places over and over. So if I kind of stay airborne not like come on wow the invincibility frames I am okay this is the first really hard level and not for particularly good reasons either it's just kind of stupid so okay yeah there we go I was gonna say if I start moving forward I will get okay so let's just keep a steady stream of fire well I was gonna keep a steady stream of fire going forward and then I got nailed so that little bit of protection is not available to us anymore. This is pretty much straight up Mario 1, right? Okay, hopefully this is really short though. I don't want to get I don't want to get surprised near the end of a level. Don't want to This is this would be an especially crappy one to die at the end of, but I think I'm there. Yep, that was pretty much uh, I'm around the wheel you're watching Super Mario Brothers 3 mix. There we go. Let's get out of here. That one was actually uh, mildly unpleasant, but we get a Toad House. We did burn through a few power-ups, and maybe we can even get some more in the In Spade game down there. Let's let's pick up something to help salve our wounds. A frog suit. Don't mind if I do. That sounds like a lot of fun. But how am I going to know which level I can use it in? We haven't really seen any. Okay, here we go. Let's try to pick up something fun. Okay, so one up right here. Also right here. Nope, that's a tin coin. How about here? There we go. Got slightly mixed up earlier. A star? I'm gonna guess here. Nope. Well, we only got a one-up, so no new power-ups added to our arsenal. Let's go- <laughs> Wow, they sure do love- I, I know I bring it up every time, but it always- it always surprises me a little. We're getting some Iceland action here in Waterland with white Koopa shells. That's- that's a that's a that's a spiffy little okay there we go all right just some just some rompy little platforming action doesn't look like anything terrible oh here's the water part okay so we can so we've got okay 
Okay, yeah, that, I think that invalidates the spike ball once you get that going on that. Alright, let's put a little splickety splack on that. There we go. Hey, a one up. I'm up to 14 lives now. Alright. Not probably gonna reach no 99, as I like to do in Mario games. This doesn't seem like it's gonna be pretty short anyway. Hey! Coins, eh? Good thing I have a tail here. I think I'd be more comfortable again though with a What was that? That was some kind of uh that was some kind of crazy reskinning nonsense. Something happened to that ball when I killed it. Or maybe it didn't. Maybe it just maybe it looked the way it should normally. Alright, let's just flower it up. Ooh, I have a chance of getting three lives at the end of it. Okay, if I can if I can seal the deal with a flower. I don't even think I've ever gotten three flowers in my entire life. Come to think of it. That's kind of a it's kind of a hard combo to get. Maybe it's harder than the one I was talking about earlier. Oh, speaking of hard things to get, some one ups. Thank you. I don't mind if I do. That's tasty. Some tasty Amanita Muscaria. Let's grind it up and microdose it into a Hammer Brothers stoop. Oh! Okay, alright. This is certainly an interesting... Oh, wow! How did that hammer not hit me? That was... That was pretty wild. Okay, and I completely missed with the tail whack there, but I get a star out of it. Stars are always nice. Maybe we can star chain in some level or the other. That'll be fun. Let's pick up another prize before we do the completely optional level 4 here. Okay, so hit me with it. A mushroom. Well, mushrooms are useful. One hit is better than no hits, I suppose. I've never been one to begrudge the mushroom. Hey, I missed a spade game down there. Okay, finally, some actual legitimate water action. But boy, boy are my eyes... Okay, let's jump over the blooper. <laughs> yes, I have the advantage of aquatic... You are an entirely aquatic animal, but I, I can go on land, unlike you, a big idiot. Okay. Okay, let's make sure this thing doesn't... Okay, maybe this would be a good place to use the frog suit. Kind of inclined to die on purpose to see if I can make it happen. Okay, so... Maybe we can go... And, ooh, the fast cheap cheeps. I remember them. They're not in the original game. No, they're in the original game like one time, I think. They're in the, you know what? I kind of I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna eat this death. It's easy enough to get power ups, but I want to see if the frog suit actually comes in handy. Let's go ahead and use our frog suit. I don't see any real. There we go. There we go. Now we can probably maneuver around the blooper pretty well. There we go. Wait for you to rise up. Ha <laughs> ha! Rise up. Bloopers of the world unite. You have nothing to lose but your but your tentacles. Kind of reminds me, <laughs> kind of reminds me of the Gooper Blooper fight and such. Ah, well now we'll never know, will we? Boy, this is this was a cursed episode. Oh god, yeah. Please do not jet stream me up into the blooper. I've already embarrassed myself quite enough for one day. I bet that was the pipe right there. I bet that was the one to go in because look at this. This is this has exit pipe written all over. Oh well, or not. It's got generator pipe written all over. Who wants to? Who wants to play Goombas in the water? There's the weird looking cheap cheap. The the black spiky one. Got kind of a got kind of a weird overbite thing going on. Hey, I, I don't mean to alarm you, but you got stuck in the thing there, my boy. Yeah, surely one of these would have led to a thing. These boy, this is a this is quite a linear little level here. Let's avoid getting lava lotused if we can, that'd be nice. Kind of inclined to see if there's a power up here. Yes, please. Don't do the weird floaty thing and end up going off into the pit. I would hate that a lot. What is up with the Goomba generating pipes in the water? Like, talk about, I mean, I guess it's a little bit of flavor, but talk about kind of a supremely useless obstacle. Purple and gold water. Purple and gold were actually the colors of my school district growing up. It's, it's quite a saucy combination of colors, if I do say so myself. And boop. Oh, yeah, baby. Flower, flower, flower. That's what I call the botanical jackpot. I call it that, and literally no one else in human history. I think this is a Wendy fight. Hey, I dig the purple, uh, I dig the digs, Wendy. That's, that's pretty rad, but this is kind of an easy fight. I feel like I really could have, really could have nailed it with the fire suit. That would have been a lot of fun. Get those, get that big air. 
Air Mario sneakers now available for sale at Nintendo World in New York City. I'm sure. So as we as we descend this mortal plane, drop off another scepter with another transformed king. There we go. Feel a little sad. We could have gotten the frog suit message if I was not such a horrible maneuverer. Here is a letter from the princess. We're going to take our letter from the princess and we're going to move on to World 4 Giant Land, which has to offer a music box. The white block contains magic powers. Something out of my throat there. That will enable you to defeat your enemies. Well, thanks for the music box. I don't think we're going to be skipping any Hammer Brother fights, though. They're pretty easy, all told. But uh, Giant Land, not anymore. This has been, uh, wow, a completely optional Hammer Brother fight. That's weird.